Hi everyone, and welcome back to some more Stormworks Build and Rescue. Now, some of you that play Stormworks might have seen this awesome helicopter before. It is just incredible. I'm trying to find out what to seat to sit in. Here we go. Check this out. The MRR-5. This is a modular helicopter for all types of missions. Now, I have to say, we look pretty stinking cool sitting in here. But, um, the helicopter is pretty simple. Um, you got the roll, pitch, yaw, and the up and down stuff. You, it's, I think it's all electric, I'm not too sure, but, yeah, this area is, has to do with the, <clears throat> um, different modules you can have. Now, let's get this show on the road. Hmm, okay. Oh, yeah, I remember all this. So, cockpit systems power. Um, we don't want reserve battery. Um, main power's on. Enable nose wheel driving. We want that so we can drive. We want to get out of here because this is a helicopter. Now, I have planted the subnor that is made by Lorgs. All of this is made by Lorgs, which makes it ten times awesomer. Over there, I planted them the subnor, which is another module. It's a tiny module or submarine you could attach to this thing. So, yep, I just planted that. And we're going to try to pick it up. Um, we don't really need all of this. Maybe the spotlight? Navigation lights, beacon lights. There's a winch. I'll flip another mission. Okay, so it's pretty self explanatory. Sort of. Not really. Nope. Why'd I flip that button? So I'm pretty sure we gotta hold down this. No. This. Yeah, till that gets to like two, I think. And this is just the rotor clutch. So that is making this thing speed up, which is pretty important. I think we're good. No, what did I do? I did a bad. I didn't start a compressor. It's this thing we needed to do. Oops. So when this gets to two, I believe. Yep. We're good. The rotor is speeding up. We're good. So there's actually a ducted fan in the back here, which is pretty good for propulsion. And you notice, 
all of the like blade stuff is exposed so you could easily just repair this with a welding torch if you hop on up there now let's get this thing up into the air there's also this awesome map system which i love i don't know how he does it but it's just amazing Let's get on this camera. That's a good camera. Okay. We have liftoff. Yes. We got two, 30 meters. And it'll stay here. Why are we going down? Why does it feel like we're going down, but we're not? I don't know. Um, landing gear? Is, is there a landing gear? Where's the landing gear? Landing. Yep, on the camera you can see the landing gear is going up. Now, let's go get this submarine. What's going on? I don't think this is supposed to happen. Oh, right, that's the pitch. Um, sorry. I'm not used to this whole different control thing. What's going on? So there's a submarine out there. We should be able to connect it. What's going on? No, that's the pitch. Wait, no. We want the pitch. So we can go. Surprisingly, when you do this pitch, it um, stays at the same exact altitude. Oh my. Goodbye. <laughs> um, submarine dude. You know, I think we should do this with not a s submarine that's in the middle of the ocean. How about that? Let's, um, let's just abandon the whole submarine thing and let's get a different attachment. Yeah, submarine, not ah. Okay, so I got a new helicopter and I got a module. Now, how to put this thing on? You simply, um, yeah. So, um, I just put this thing into, like, next to the helicopter in the building menu, and then you just back up into it, open this door, and turn on this switch, and it'll just bump on, like so. Now it's attached to the helicopter. Next thing you're going to want to do is grab this thing. And it's right next to the door over there. And you're going to want to attach it to the dashboard. Get on there. Yeah. Oh no, it's the wrong way around. Wait, why do I have a flare gun? Um, where did I get this? Here, store. 
Yeah, this thing has all the equipment equipment you would ever need. Come on. Work already. Could you please work for me? That would be great. I'll get this thing eventually. Okay. So this, when you attach it to the dashboard, has all the controls for the different modules. So say, if you got the bombing module, it would have an option to drop the bombs, or say for the um, SAR module, which I'm, which I have on right now, search and rescue. Um, it would have these controls, which is for like the water cannon and all the other stuff, gimbal cameras and such. So now we got it connected. And look at all the gear he got in here. Yeah, a lot of stuff. This is to release the container, which usually you don't want to do. <laughs> so in the SAR module, you got, you know, the back door, so it can go on either direction. You got so many seats. You got these drop a thing of bobs that go down, harnesses. You got more search and rescue stuff. To, like repair boats and stuff and yeah it's pretty much it now let's go save some people okay this is modular m r r five reporting for duty you're taking out the SAR modular to go rescue um, a boat. No, not a boat. A car, actually. A vehicle. Let's set our waypoint for autopilot. Okay. We can roll out a bit. Awesome. Now there's a ton of different more modules you can um, check it out on Lorg's um, um, Steam account they're everywhere and there's also a blank one for your so you can make your own okay what's the mass 2261 okay then you're gonna look at this and say um, we gotta set it to two. The throttle, up to two. About. And... Perfect. Two point two. Nice. Spotlight on, and we're good to go. Adios, amigos. We have liftoff. Oh, right, the rotor RPS. Almost forgot about that. Yep. In the shadow, you can see it moving fast okay no 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 that's not good we gotta get it to two bam so now that will speed up itself and we will um, go 
to space. <laughs> well, we don't want to go to space, but... Yeah. Or glitch off. No, I think we want that on. <laughs> okay. We shall have takeoff. Okay. Any second now. Why isn't this working? Can someone please explain why this is not working? This should be. Oh, the engine fuel valve's off. That explains a lot. Ha. And stupid. Okay, now we're off. MRR5 reporting for duty. Yeah, awesome camera view. And take off. I said take off. Might have said take off. Here we go. Take off. Perfect. Landing gear up. Now, we're good to go save some people. Wow, this thing looks awesome. Okay. Never mind that. Let's set the altitude nice and high. Let's set it to like 200. So we don't hit any mountains. We can set that to that. Okay. Um, is there a button here for autopilot activate? Maybe. Uh, here we go. Altitude hold activate. Now we should start going up. And um, are we high enough? We are. Good. We gotta go higher to make it open. Up. This is actually like the fifteenth time I've been I've recorded this video and I kept crashing into that mountain, which is terrible. I'm just tired. Okay, and how high are we? 108. Okay, yeah, we were gonna make it. And go. Now we should have takeoff. Let's go ahead and um, bump up the ducted fan speed. Get to the ten, yeah, And now you just sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I think it's time for an awesome time lapse. Bet it, go. Okay, everybody, I think I located the car crash. Let's bring her down.
This is MRR5, number 47, reporting for duty. We have discovered the four people. Bring them to the hospital now. <sighs> Okay, ease into it. We got four people. A car crash. Oops. What did I do? This is where the SAR module comes in handy, folks. Hmm. What's our best way to get him in here? Right. We just make them follow us. Now, where's the hospital? Oh, yeah. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna land here. Beep. Beep. Beep, 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 beep. Landing gear. Look at that awesome gimbal camera. I discovered the gimbal camera is the fourth setting onto this, which is cool. Okay. Hi, people. I have came to save your life. You're welcome. And touchdown. Great. Um, let's put on the brakes. And let's keep the rotors on. And put on remote control so it doesn't fly away. Yeah, let's grab this. Good. Let's save some people. Wow, we look awesome. Okay, hi peeps. What's up? I'm here to save you. Hello. Hi. Yeah. This is a nice car. How'd you crash it? It looks perfectly fine. I can't even open the doors. Did you crash it? Like, hold up. Does it? Does it run? Hazards. Parking brake. Um, does it still run? If this runs, yeah, it doesn't. Okay, you're fair. There. Oh no. Help me. Ah. Okay, everybody. Even you with the pansy hat. Wait, is that a hat or an afro? <laughs> That's an afro, not a hat. Okay, um. You, you gotta follow me. Football dude. Um. Terminator looking dude and old grandpa. You're gonna come with me. Everyone, follow me to the helicopter. Now I think we're also gonna be able to pick up the car. Is everyone coming? We got Granny, Terminator dude, football dude, and Afro dude. Yep, everyone's coming. That should be a song. Terminator dude, grandpa, grandma dude, afro dude, football dude, dun 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 Okay. Come on, everybody. 
Yep, this is your awesome stylish ride. Yeah, you're gonna be riding it. Come on, Afro dude. We know you're gonna be the last one in. Uh, Lori's creation or creations are always the best. Okay, everybody, hop in. Hop in the module. Get in here. It's pretty important. We didn't need the harnesses. It was only a car crash. Well, only a car crash. That makes it sound bad. Okay, you. Um, I'm gonna pick you up, and I'm gonna put you in the seat. I'm gonna pick you up, and I'm gonna put you in the seat. Everyone get in the seat, and you, Granny, I got something for you. Afro Man. You guys are going to the hospital. You know, Granny, you can go in the bed so you can get healed up. And Terminator Man, get in the bed so you can guys can heal up. Perfect. Let's hope I complete this mission. Okay, um, can I heal you? I just healed myself. I don't want to do that. Okay. Everybody, is everyone strapped in? And good. You're good. Okay. Bye, everybody. Now, that car, we need to bring it to the um, maintenance shop. Totally. We totally need to bring it to the maintenance shop. Well, we can bring it to the maintenance, but we don't want to because it'll be hard to navigate over there. But there is actually bottom connectors to the, to the, all the modules, so you can actually pick up that car as well. Hmm, let's see if I can actually pick up that car. That'd be awesome. Everyone's in the back, you can see him through the window. Awesome. We gotta get this car because it's their um, family business car and they won't leave without it, they said. This helicopter is a little floaty, but that's pretty much what all helicopters are like. game. Let's see if we can pick this up. Probably won't. But we'll give it a shot anyway. Okay. Easy. Easy. Easy mode. Easy mode. Just gotta go forward a little bit. Cause this thing's really floaty. I mean, I don't think there's any vehicle more floaty. Okay, I think we're above it. We're definitely not above it. It's not like we have to race them to the hospital or anything. They're perfectly fine. <laughs> Except for Granny. And maybe Elvis. <laughs> he looked like Elvis. 
Okay. Landing gear up. Let's, um... Oh, it's loud. Here. Hi, everybody. We're back. Um... I would like to drop you guys, but I can't because I'll lose my phone. Oh, hi. <laughs> hi. Hi. It's right under the staircase. But I can't get to it. No. Looks like we're not going to be able to pick up the car. Wait a second. No, we, we will. Because we have a winch. I forgot about the winch. I completely forgot about the winch. Okay. Winch time. Is the winch going down? I'm not too sure. Here. Winch do do. Is the winch coming down anytime soon? I don't think the winch is. Yep, the winch isn't coming. Did that do something? No, I didn't. Well, um, that was fun. Um, I guess I'll See you guys next time. I'm gonna drop these dudes off at the hospital. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Hold up. Oh, wait. We're at the hospital. Bad. Bye! Mwahahaha. <laughs>